The police called it a disturbance. The students called it a riot. Either way, the 1988 homecoming was different than any before and after at St. Cloud State University. My name is Tom Stamen. I'm the University Archivist here at St. Cloud State. I've been here since July 2007. It was October 14th and October 15th, 1988. Uh, students uh, along 3rd Avenue South between the 400 and 500 block of that area. So it's actually one block up north from the parking garage. Uh, we're congregating um, and there was a uh, disturbance that the police had to come. Some people felt it was a riot. Others said it was not a riot. So police had uh, cleared students out who were congregating about, uh, starting fires, cars were flipped over. There were other homes too, so they were uh, taking furniture off the porches of these homes and, and burning them. People believe the police were, were a little heavy-handed and they were arrested for, as you could say, no reason. It's estimated that there were 800 to 1,000 people who were on this block or two-block area. People saying, you know, it, it was various different things you know, whether it was a riot or not. After the event, students were looking towards the future and planning to clear the university's bad image. It's part of the university's history. I'm sure there's other things that maybe the, the university's not proud of, um, but I, it's certainly something I don't, people should, should not know about it.